munga wao ndo wanaenda kwa mozu kumaki but munyuma muli munyuma praise the
So, problem with our I think it's one So, So, I would rather have someone who can not cite in my mind. When I'm wrong, I must be corrected. When she's wrong, she must be corrected. Praise God. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Mind must be positive. Thinking. Praise God. Hallelujah. Always think positive. No matter the talent, things are going to be fine. They say to the righteous, it is well with them. Always. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Say to the righteous, it is well. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So you see, for many people, one day, go to the that to see the one that you think it was on on Monday. Now, do you know that it's not really about the education that makes a man? Praise the Lord. Amen. You can have a great job in your home, but still be a destitute with your certificate, with your degree, with your whatever. So, the mm -hmm. move to the and Zeva, not the paper. Praise So, move to the and Zeva, you don't really need the paper. Praise the On Monday, I was with Apostle Philip, Tom Gorey. Praise the Lord. So, I don't know who's our so we are on the You heard that? Yes. And we are on the video for others. Praise the Lord. So we are discussing the 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 how to do the place. Especially the church going goes to the praise the Lord. So we are busy discussing. So they ask me a question. That how do somebody dress as they are going to church? They said, no, 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 when we are going to church, we should be able to dress decent. No, I didn't use the word decent. I use the uh, modesty. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. I didn't use decent. I use modesty. Mm -hmm. So when it was time for, 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 for callers to contribute, praise the Lord. So go to my phone or now. This certain teacher called. I said the uh, that speaker that he spoke about the uh, 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 modesty. That word modesty is very wrong. Can you imagine? He said that word modesty is very wrong. He can't speak modesty because the meaning modesty, the meaning of a problem with church modesty. Huh? The meaning of modesty. So uh, we end, so he ended the call. Huh? So I was asking people to do what I said about you. That the man did not differentiate between modern and modest. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Amen. So there are two different ways. So me, I, I, I try to defend the man. He said, no, no, no. I think he did not hear me clearly. I didn't say modern. I said modest. The foolish man called again. <laughs> I said, the foolish man called again. A teacher. He says, I'm a teacher, I, te I teach children. All right, <laughs> <laughs> huh? he said, the, the, he called again and said, he, he, I'm a teacher, I teach children. So that man made a mistake. May I, I was trying to correct him. I said, I'm sure I'm very good, you know. He needs to be more than, to be more than this thing. Which is why we are going to be more than this thing. More than this thing, more than this more than They are the same words. <laughs> Teacher, teacher, who puts the one to school? Teacher. <laughs> so the man argued in such a way that even my present in the studio, my number of believers are here. That even the people that are in the studio, they are well, where, where I was, I felt like I made a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like an apology to you. <laughs> in such a way, I was with Mr. Kamau. Now, let's ask the teacher, what is the difference between 
Monday and modest. You also don't know. <laughs> Monday and modest. <laughs> Yes. If I say modesty, yeah. it means somebody who is dressing decent. I can relate it to decent. Yes. Okay. Then if I say modest, th these are kind of clothes that people are putting nowadays with really? the yeah. with the white. <laughs> Uh, mode, mode, mode is, is, is kind of good manners or decent, decent, decent dressing. This is modest. Huh? Yes. Wow, modern is a now time. Huh? Yes. Now time. <laughs> These are modern, modern. not too modern. 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 That is now modern. So the man had the audacity, eh? <laughs> the temerity, <laughs> the effrontery. <laughs> At least when I was in the studio, I was in Mr. Kamau's office. So I couldn't talk the way I'm talking now. Now that this is my office, I must talk. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, so the my So I even felt the guilty because the Zuma's are on the campaigns. Ah, we take no dictionary. The report. Hallelujah. 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 So now that I'm in my office, I must talk. So if you know that foolish man who called, go and tell them that he said you are a very big fool. Hallelujah. We should do fire him, man. Because I'm trying to corrupt you and some other street. Praise the Lord. Some of you are straight. So I'm just going to tell you that I'm a so if that man was wise, he was going to listen, he was made to defend him. No, 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 Sumuna Vele, no, do my foot. Put on the right hand and then boost. 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 So we go back to our last point. Thanks, give me. Put on the right hand and then boost. No, no, no. Uh, we have a treat in Mark chapter 11, verse 23, on the positive declaration. Praise the Lord. Amen. Mark chapter 11, verse 23. Mark chapter 11, verse 23. Mark chapter 11, verse 23. The Bible says, Truly I say to you, whoever says to this mountain, be taken up and thrown into the sea, and does not doubt in his heart, but believes that what he says will come to pass, it will be done for him. He says, truly I do what to say unto you, that whosoever shall say, whosoever shall do what? Shall say. Whosoever shall do what? Shall say. say. So you don't say with your neighbor's mouth, you say it with your own mouth. Oh yes. Mm -hmm. Say, you mountain, be thou removed and it cast into the sea. If you don't doubt the word you speak, it says you are going to see results. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So if you speak and you know what I've spoken, I cannot doubt my words. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Then there will be backup. 
miracle will be seen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. You don't show confidence outside. You must the confidence you speak those words must come inside you from your heart. You speak while you believe, knowing that whatsoever I speak now, it shall happen. Amen. What it means there, mountain, it means problems that people are facing today. Amen. Poverty that people are facing today. That's the mountain the Bible is talking about. Sickness that we are facing today. That's the Bible is talking about. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So the Bible is saying, if you say with your mouth, you say with your tongue that you mountain be thou removed, you believe inside your heart, the mountain will scatter. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So you and me, we know that when we say something according to the word of God, Amen. knowing that whatever I say now, it must surely scatter. Oh, yes. Now that you know, you can say HIV, get out. <laughs> Cancer, get out. You jobless thing, get out. You laziness, get out. You're a free man. Oh, yes. mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. You know, for you to be free is what you believe. When you don't believe anything, you can't be free. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. When you know and believe that I will be free, you will be free. The woman with the issue of blood, she believed and said, I will be here. Praise the Lord. Amen. She said in her heart, she said it. Faith in a heart. Praise the Lord. If I can only do that, things will happen this way. So the same was from the heart. Every prayer you make to God, if the prayer is from the heart, God must answer you. Praise the Lord. If you can pray heart to heart with God, then there will be a miracle. When you can pray heart to heart with God, then there will be a miracle. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So the number 12 one is a thanks living. Don't try to give people. I said the thanks living. Praise the Lord. Amen. Thanks for what? Amen. Thanks for what? Amen. Thanks for what? Amen. No thanks giving, madam. I said the thanks living. Praise the Lord. Anytime you are grateful with what God has done for you, God is ready to do the next thing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That step where you and me are now, if we can agree and say, Father, we thank you for this small thing that you have done, then God is ready to graduate you to the next level. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So what God will do, he will give you a two quarter to see whether you are grateful or not. So if you are not grateful, he will not give you four quarter. Praise the Lord. Amen. Now, the good part with God, God knows everybody here. Nobody can teach you, cheat him, all right? Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Amen. God knows that when he gives you money, you stop to <coughs> it. He knows. There are people here that God is very much aware of. If I make this one rich, his life will be destroyed. Fully aware. No, 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 no,
Praise the Lord. When you can make it to heaven, then God is happy. When you cannot make it, he's worried. Praise the Lord. No matter how much money you have, when you cannot make it to heaven, God is worried. There are many rich people today that they are heading to hell. God is very much worried. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. When we learn to be grateful, God is ready to give us more blessing. Do you know what I mean to be grateful? Every day, because we said last week we said we must every time expect favor in our daily basis. Praise the Lord. So now when a little favor has come and you are not grateful, better favor will not come. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. When small favor, God has favor to small, just a bit. Mm -hmm. And you cannot recognize to say, this is God that has done this. And not thanking him. He will not give you the next level. You and me will agree that every time we are praying for next level, give me next level, next level, next level of life. But we have not thanked him well as <laughs> Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Sir, if you cannot give thanks to God with this jacket that you are putting on, how much did you buy it? You are just giving. Uh, how much can it be? Can you guess? What? Let's put it at that much. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So if this jacket. This man was not grateful when he was given the jacket of 100 water. God can never give him a jacket of 1,000. He knows that when he gives you something, he will be wasting. So God has got no breakthrough, no miracle, no marriages to waste. He doesn't have it. He has something that when he gives to you, you yield fruits. You go back to him and say, Father, I thank you. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. I've seen people where we we'll pray for them. After praying for them, when it's testimony time, they will not come. Praise the Lord. Because this is what we need to thank to thank God for. Praise the Lord. We must live a life of thanksgiving at every point. This small thing that you have done for God, oh Lord, I'm grateful. I know better things are coming. According to, to what we, we, we said, we, we must have positive thinking, positive saying, always declaring. So now that God has healed me with this small sickness, I know better things are coming for me. Now, if God is able to answer small prayer, it means even bigger prayer, he can answer it. Big, big prayers, he will still answer Present. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. But the first thing, we must be grateful with the small things that we have. The Bible says, do not despise the humble beginning. Because your humble beginning, your gratitude, that's what determines where you are going tomorrow. When you are grateful today, tomorrow you will be more grateful. The other day you'll be more grateful every day, brighter and brighter until the perfect day. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. So every time when we live a life of thanksgiving, God adds blessing in our lives. Small favor that God has given me to wear a suit, to wear a shoe, I must give him thanks. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, hear me. By the grace of God, one day, me, me, one day, me, Nzaka Varsu, the attend team. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God, you can't get a boy with your day. So, my prayer should not die. Amen. Praise the Lord. That you are going to witness these things when they happen. <laughs> With this small money that God has blessed me, I'm able to give him thanks. Oh, yes. My friend, nobody can do it apart from God himself. Oh, yes. 
Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Gradually we are changing. You, I know where I'm coming from. I was not like this. But little by little things are changing. I give God the glory. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It is only his doing. What we eat at home, the doing of God. What we wear, the doing of God. The work, the doing of God. The small, small business that I'm running, the doing of God. Praise the Lord. Because that's why God is graduating me bit by bit. Because he, I'm able to differentiate what God has done and what a man has done. Praise the Lord. Amen. When you know this is the finger of God, you are appreciative. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. In the Bible, there were ten people that had lepers. So God, Jesus prayed for them. They went their way. One of them came back and said, Let me go back and give thanks to this man. Says you, you have so when she, he returned, God, Jesus told him, You, you have thank, thank me. Your healing is protected. Oh, yes. mm -hmm. So, meaning the healing of the night was not perfect. Mm -hmm. So, it's possible we can pray for you and get healing now. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. It's possible we can pray for you and get healing now. Now, because you have not testified, you still go back with the same problem. We talk about the the same problems attack you again. Because the thanksgiving, Ima Siddinga my blessing, it seals the blessing. It makes the blessing permanent when we give thanks to God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Listen to me. When we thank God for the small things, we are ready for the next step. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. By all means, let us learn to be grateful to what God is doing in our lives. That every day God can do better things and new things. Praise Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. So we must live a life of thanksgiving every time. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Psalm 104, verse 1. Psalm 104, verse 1. Thanksgiving. We are thanking for what he has done. Let's go again to Psalm 105, verse 1 again. Psalm 105, verse 1. All give thanks to the Lord. All give thanks to the Lord. Call upon his name. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the people. Sing to him. Sing praises to him. Care of all his wondrous ways. Hey, I interpret better. The same, the same, the script. Read again. All give thanks unto the Lord. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the people. Sing unto him. Sing psalms unto him. Don't hear all his wondrous works. Glory ye in his holy name. Let the heart of them rejoice that seek the Lord. Praise the Lord. 
Clap for me now. I think he's able to take the place. He's able to perform. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Have you not found it? Uh, what would you pattern? Did I break any way for me? No. Better. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Also, Acts chapter 2, verse 47. Yes, verse 47. Acts chapter number 2, verse 47. Acts chapter 2, verse 47. The Bible says, Praising God and having favor with all the people. Praising God and having favor with all the people. And the Lord added to their number day by day those who are being saved. And the Lord added the number day by day. day, by day. Those who are being saved. To those who are being saved. But the first is but there, what did he say? He says, praising God and having favor. With praising God and having favor. So God can never add anything if we cannot appreciate him. Am I talking to somebody? Amen. If we are not giving thanks to him, we cannot add nothing in our lives. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Because we say life is in levels, right? Mm -hmm. So for our level where we are today, if we must change, is to appreciate God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The salary that you are getting, you thank God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. The salary that you are getting, you should be able to do what? Because they, not everybody that is getting the same salary you are getting. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Some of them, they don't have a job completely. Now you, you work, you get 500, you are complaining. What kind of a man are you? Ask those who are not working, ask them if they touch, they, they, they hold 500 quarter in their hands. This is the reason we must live in a life of Thanksgiving daily. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because we lack gratitude. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. How many are blessed? Amen. How many are blessed? Amen. So if at all, at some point, there is a favor that God, you know, this is only from God. What God did this and that and that and that for me. If you are able to appreciate it, then God will bring next level of blessing. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The level of life or the standard you live now today, if you are able to say thank you to God, then God will change the standard tomorrow. You will find yourself at a level, different level, that you were not before. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We should be able to appreciate God. If you are a business, if we are able to appreciate the business, you are blessed. Amen. You are blessed. Amen. You are blessed. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now we are going to stand and pray. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. First thing we are going to give thanks to Him because before now we didn't know the small small things that God had done in our lives that we are supposed to thank Him. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So when we are going to thank Him today. 
then he, he will open up more blessing. Blessing the rain. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The most important thing is always remember what God is doing in your life. <coughs> Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Imagine you cast with 200 children. Remember example, you want to talk about number one, number 10. Can you appreciate God for that? Okay. Hallelujah. <laughs> It is now after we thank God that even in Ramazan College it is up there. Amen. But the first level here, yeah, grade one to grade four, if we are able to thank God for that only, then God is able to take us to colleges. Amen. If you have come back from college and there is no job, you will thank Him for the paper that you have. Yes. Praise the Lord. Amen. That tomorrow He can give you a job. That is to say, paper is a member of the government. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Mm. Hallelujah. In case you have a guarantee to write a graduate team, we will be the same. That is what we call promotion. The Bible says it is the only God that promotes people. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So, promotion is to come out and say, okay, I'm going to from today, I'm going to be a senior teacher. I'm going to be a senior teacher, whatever, whatever. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. Even changing your salary. Is promotion. Amen. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? When every day you are getting better salary, for example, Musha is doing most, but you fall and drama Zambi. It means God has favored you. Oh, yes. Praise the Lord. Amen. But whatever God is doing now, we should be able to appreciate it. Or else, there is no future for us. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Stand on your feet, somebody. Amen. So when you are thanking God, you are not thanking God because your neighbor is also thanking God. No, 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 no. You are thanking God knowing that this is what God has done in my life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Do not despise the humble beginning. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow you can be a better person. Oh, yes. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Tomorrow you can be a manager. Oh, yes. Tomorrow you can get married well. Mm -hmm. Your life tomorrow can change. Oh, yes. You are not driving today. Tomorrow things can be better. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. But it, it takes our gratitude today that will take us to the next level. Oh, yes. Lift your voice. You know what God has done in your life.